Well, apparently something's going on for her to act like that. Anyway, let's start searching the upstairs rooms. Maybe we'll find an oval painting. We are not going through this door. We got a hint from the, uh, the walkie-talkie. There is danger there, so we are not going there. And the crying starts up again. Anyway, this game kind of has some performance issues. You know what? Let's go out here. I think things are still loading. Alright, so this is like... Yeah, like a balcony. It's gonna be hard to turn on this floodlight if I don't plug it in. If I had some clips for the battery post, I'm sure I could get the floodlight to turn on. Alright, well, we got another thing to do. This sack must have soil in it for the plants. The plants outside look better than the plants inside. Well, yeah, they possibly can get rained on. And they're getting sunlight. Oh, tongs. Grill tongs. Grill tongs with a wooden handle. Perfect for cooking a uh, barbecue. Uh, these are some fine tongs. Good grip. Oh, oh, oh. I wonder if it can be used as a clamp. Happy anniversary. There's a bottle that just says wine on it. Hilarious. Alright, so... Air conditioning unit. Looks like there's a, a third story to this house. Let's try it. All I'm gonna do with that is make a short circuit to the... in the battery, okay. Never mind then. Guess if we need to pick something up, we can use the tongs. Look at that creepy-ass statue. Uh, let's start over this way, even though I have a very bad feeling about it. You listen. Not really hearing anything. I mean, will the sound always show up immediately? Or will it take a while? Yeah, I think it might be safe. Here's hoping. Uh, I don't like the noise. It is just an old record player. And yeah, that painting right there, kind of creepy. Uh, elevation plan of the Husher Mansion. An elevation of the mansion with some notes on it. The scaffold goes here. How many balconies do they have? So that's on... Yeah, because there's a front, front porch area. Okay. Scaffold goes here. Oh, uh... Yeah, this, this is bad. Maybe it was just an open window? Guess we're going in? Mierda. Hello, ma'am? Okay, so there's crying on the other side. I guess it's locked from the other side. I need to find a way to get in there. Well, someone who does not want to get it out or let anyone in 
What was that noise? We're surrounded by noises. Okay. Uh, God, I thought maybe for a second there was something in the, on the, the, behind the door on the other side, but no, it's just the reflection of the light. Ooh, let's look back out. Maybe something has changed. Okay, a door just opened, and I think someone said, hey. Ah! Why was that? <sighs> god damn. God, god damn. There's something up with this door. Definitely, definitely think we should avoid this door. And the one in the study. I mean, how long do you have to listen before you could possibly hear anything? Down in the dining room when we, uh, listened after that event, there was something immediate. Now it's like, I'm worried my volume is too low to be able to hear anything, but we're going in. Oh, there's a child! <laughs> what the hell? Holy shit. Okay. Many bathroom products not opened yet. Maybe they're for the guests. Dishcloth, a dirty dishcloth. Probably, it is nice, like a sponge when you touch it. Oh, we can clean up. Ooh, I like that effect. Bravo. Bravo. It's actually pretty cool. Anyway, we can clean up that spill. Hmm. That glass sure got a lot of dust on it. I just, I don't. I don't, I don't like anything about this. Should we go investigate? Of course the view is horrible. I, uh... You know what? At the very beginning, it always says, better safe than sorry. I'm gonna take that to heart. We can't listen to verify, so we're just not gonna bother. What the shit? Why does it... We haven't been through this door, right? No, we haven't. You know, I'm gonna listen for a while, just in case. Just to be safe. Okay, good luck, Alina. Nope. Oh, it's jammed. Well, that's that. There is this door, though. It's like sometimes I think I can hear something. But I don't know. Okay. Good luck, Alina. This is a bad time to be scratching my nose. 
Uh, dry paint and some messed up paintbrushes. The shelves are full of stains from a long time ago. Okay, there's noises. Old paintings. Uh, they piled up in the corner like old junk. They're from 1883 and 1790. So old. But... Are any of them oval shaped? And uh you can see something was dragged under the trap door here. Trap door. Tongs? No way, Jose. I can't reach up that far. Uh they closed the trap door. To open it, I need something to pull on that thing up there. Okay. And look, another camera. Well, we're going back downstairs. Upstairs is creepy as all hell. Wait, wait, wait. No, no, we're not going there. We're gonna wait on that. Too much, too much shit going down. Okay. Yeah, let's, uh, go downstairs. We will clean up the, uh, the spill and there's noises again. When shit happens, she reacts to it, so at least that's a good hint. Where are we going? Gods. I, uh, one of the negative reviews for this game was they encountered insta-kill doors without any warning. That's how they lost all their characters in episode one. They couldn't hear anything. So I'm kind of worried about that. Mm -hmm. Okay, I got the water dried up. Oh gods, I don't want to go down to the basement. <laughs> and we have to go back down there. And we will probably have to hide. What else can we do? What else do we have? Oh, the garage. Why is there so many noises? You know what? Why don't we just leave? Just leave and call it a night. What is out there? Looks like there's something moving around out there. Oh, god damn it. Where do we go? Where do we want to go? Where do I want to go? Is this a safe spot? I don't know. That one icon is moving around. Uh, you know what? Let's go to the garage. I am just really hesitant because I know something's going to trigger and we're going to end up having to hide because there's that wardrobe down there. Okay. Uh, remote control, examine. Hmm. Looks like the kind of remote control used for awnings on metal doors. Okay, use. If I don't get the electricity on, this will be of no use. Okay. That makes sense. But I still don't want to do it. <laughs> That's exactly what we have to do. Oh, there's going to be some shit. There's going to be some shit down here where that happens once I turn on the door. 
Everything's ominous. Or turn on the lights. Everything's ominous. It's dark down here. Something's gonna scare me. That one cupboard's gonna open again? It's doing it intentionally. She's gonna get grabbed. Okay. I came to fix the electricity. But that doesn't seem like the most important thing right now. Really? We're gonna fix the alarm and then we're out. Isn't that right, Elena? Fix the alarm, get the hell out. What more do you need to do? I'm just, I'm expecting something to happen. Well, it's a lot easier to see. That's for sure. Uh, the alarm controls are getting electricity, but the alarm was reset. Maybe I gotta activate it to make it work right. Oh, come on, Elena. Elena, Elena. Oh, is that what we gotta activate? Can we get to it? No. Hey, at least we can leave. I really like that. Let's leave. We're leaving. Uh, it is the main entrance. Uh. I know. False hope. Okay, let's, uh, do the garage, or the, yeah, the door. The garage door. Mm -hmm. Oh, shit. Okay. Mm -hmm. I turned the, off the alarm, now it should work right. Uh, we're done. We're done here, Alina. God damn it. Okay, let's do this. Because this is the next clear thing to do. Oh, the boiler! Shit. Okay, we gotta do something with the boiler, maybe? Uh, upper panel, press the left button, press the center button, press the right button. In case of malfunction, preventing correct boiler functioning, you can press an emergency shutdown by keeping the blue button pressed for four seconds. Hmm. Uh, the boiler is running. It is very damp around here, though, maybe because the pipes are leaking. Ooh. That wasn't it. This is the blue button. Uh, you don't need to turn on the heating. Okay. Maybe that wasn't the right thing to do. Maybe I wasn't supposed to do that. Alright, Alina. We have a lot of stuff in our inventory. You die. Well, I'll have to come back here to get you. Okay. At least we're outside. What was that? Battery clamps. A household pair of standard battery clamps. Hmm. Oh. The wire is insulated good. There is no risk of a short circuit when using them. Okay, so that's for the balcony. It seems the senior left a folder in the back seat. No. 
No, we're not sticking our hand in there. We could just leave. I mean, you got it working just because you couldn't find anyone. I mean, in fact, actually, you did find someone. They were... They were crying. You said you didn't want to disturb anyone. No. Like... Damn. No. Oh, I have a bad feeling. I have a bad feeling about everything. I'm just gonna, I'm just gonna be honest. Is that? No, that's the garage. Okay, I was like, is that the bathroom? That's silly. Oh, hey, is this a barbecue? In Peru, we often got together with many families to cook a big asado together. Okay. Gods, I would just be so creepy. Oh, hey, it's that one window. That one room. I guess they use these tools to fix up the yard. I think this is a window to the one room that we couldn't get into. You know, there's so many opportunities for, like, window scares. And I, I haven't really seen them in any horror games. Oh, more doors. Okay, I didn't hear anything. So this would open into that room that was locked from within. All right. All right, all right, all right, Alina. I'm sorry if you get, if you die from this. Mm -mm. Oh, they bolted the lock here. Seems like servant's entrance. Okay, well, there's no, oh. That requires a key. Ugh. Nope. What a curse, the key won't work here. Okay, okay, that's fine. That is fine. That is perfectly fine. I didn't want to go that way anyway. Uh, so... We don't have to go into the basement. The study has a place to hide. So we have the back bal balcony. And we have that one door. Well, we're not going to that one door, so we're going to the back bal balcony. And what is making that noise, by the way? Is it just this? From the wind? Oh, I heard a cat. What is that noise? Okay. Okay, for some reason we're gonna go to the back balcony. And, uh... Get scared. I just... There's all these... There's all these hiding spots and I'm just dreading when I have to hide. I expect that will be what will get her killed. Is me panicking and not finding a place to hide. Okay, so in here, in that side room in the kitchen, the dining room is places to hide. Upstairs, the study has a place to hide. Okay. This would have been super creepy if that child had run across right there. Oh, is there something on the door? No. 
okay. It's okay. Ah! Oh shit! Um, this is a new room. Okay, okay, the darkness, hiding. Something terrible is drawing near. Uh, you need to hide before it's too late. Look around you and find a place where you can go undetected. Once you're, you've interacted with a hiding place, it will appear on the map with the following symbols. Uh, time is short, hold to run. There's a wardrobe here. Yes, 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 yes. Okay, god damn it. Uh, I, I read about that in that review, this in that review. Apparently this is very difficult and this is how you easily lose characters. You managed to hide from the darkness, but the worst is yet to come. Try to keep a level head. To calm down, follow the rhythm of your heartbeat by pressing space. When the white border reaches the center of the circle, or when the white border reaches the center of the circle, don't let your heart beat too fast or you'll start to panic. Above all, else don't look at it. Ow, I'm getting clawed by a cat. Stop grabbing my leg, cat. She's dead. What just happened? Everything seems to be back to normal. Have I lost my mind? I'm about to lose my mind with this cat grind clawing my knee. Okay, we're in the playroom now. We couldn't get into this room, but she was like, nope. <laughs> Got the hell in. Uh, it would be easy for me to fit inside. Yes. Yes, it would. Oh, it's that. It's the dollhouse. What a beautiful dollhouse. It must have cost some major dinero. Huh? Uh, I do not see any doll to place here. Oh, this is like... Kind of lame toy room, huh? Uh, second drawing by Saul. A drawing done by Husher's youngest child. Them hiding from the darkness. God, this is a creepy room, complicated old toys, and so ugly. Grab the bat. I probably wouldn't do any good, but you know. Oh, so it was hiding out in that one room. Does that mean that one room is available now? You know, every time I continue a game, she always gasps like something just happened. All right. Uh. Oh. Oh, things are. Things are not good. That is, uh. Oh, come on. This is like the one time where trying to move the camera, it's not moving the way, moving the mouse. That, that is, uh, is it spreading? It's like mold. I guess it is a lot like black mold. Alright, so we got one other room. Oh, 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 the balcony. That's right. We were doing the balcony. Hopefully I do not have to hide from any more darkness this episode. Although I doubt it. Uh, yes, we have the battery. Battery is already connected to the floodlight. Oh, I have to turn it on. The floodlight can be turned on if I grab it by the handles. So is this how you defeat it?
Do you only have a little while to defeat it? What is going on here? Is this what I am supposed to do? Because it gets very close. Okay, let's try one last time. I guess maybe I will find something to help out with that, because that uh, isn't really working. Or is there something else I'm supposed to focus on? Like down over there. Oh, do I just... Okay, okay. <laughs> I am really dense. Awesome, we have that now. So now we have two rooms. I don't feel confident. But I'm also very curious about that folder down in the car. I think we should go and reconsider the folder. Then we'll come back up and uh, go through the door closest to the staircase. Oh gods. Every time! I'm hoping I have the volume up high enough. But definitely one thing we are not doing is going back to that basement. Okay, check to make sure there's no listen option. And then we'll go back out. And really... I don't know why she's staying around. Like, oh no, weird things are happening. She got chased into a wardrobe. And she still hung around. Okay. Yes. Oh my god, I thought, like, she would lose an arm or die. Haiku Folder 2, a piece of a collectible. A blue folder, there are several sheets of paper in it. Okay, is that it? Can't use it. So that looks like a two out of three. Okay, let's go back up there. We'll go into the first door. The door where all the weird shit happened. And then we'll go into the door that had the darkness. And I can kind of remember where some hiding spots are. Kitchen and the dining room. Oh shit! <laughs> ah! Wow. This game's use of uh, subtle horror is uh, terrifying. I don't. I don't. <laughs> oh gods. Okay, let's do it. I think it's safe. Uh, yeah, it's nope. locked. Okay, let's use the key. The key is useless to me now. I guess that was the last we could use of it. Let's listen, just to be careful. There's nothing, so let's go through. Ah, 
another? Oh, the darkness. Uh, I guess we turn on the light. It's totally dark in there. I can't see a thing. Well, uh, maybe we should... Okay, you know what? Before we look around, let's just turn this on. Okay, well, I guess that made it go away. Although, I'm, I'm very worried about going in there. Especially since it sounds like there's something going on in there. A boat like the ones the Spanish came to the Americas in for the first time. There is an open book, uh, but I don't understand the strange language. Is that it? Just two items of interest. All right, let's. Uh, I would like to listen. <laughs> okay, maybe we gotta leave. I can't, I can't. She's gonna die. She's gonna die. There's no place to hide. I'm sorry, Elena. We got trapped. Oh, finally things calm down a little. Oh, uh, we're trapped. <laughs> I think we're trapped. Cause it looks like it's it's just on the other side. Okay, those records are so old. Uh, ooh. Red rag doll. A rag doll with a flower in her hair. Is this the ugly one? Huh? What a beautiful doll with her little mouth open. Uh, I would not want to live in such a lonely place. Um, uh, Masha's recording. A voice recording of the Husher Mansion housekeeper, Masha. The label on the cassette reads September 11th, 1998. I am starting to worry. A few days ago, Mrs. Catherine started sleeping in Saul's room with the children. She's been avoiding me lately. Is she ashamed of something? <laughs> I don't know what's going on. Is she... Are we doomed? Okay, well... Someone started packing but never finished. I only see clothes in one of the bags. I am... I am... So afraid to go out there. I think, uh... I think she's dead. I think she's going to die. Because, look at that. Okay, so I decided to look up what the stats do and get a better understanding of the game mechanics and what's going on with her radio. Uh, so with the radio, it just shows when the presence is nearby, not necessarily that an item or a uh, door is dangerous. So uh, I can probably go back to that door in the study. Also, running around isn't a good idea. It draws the attention of the, uh, the presence. Uh, but characters with high stealth uh, don't draw its attention as much. And speed is, as far as I could, I found out, is just how quickly a character moves. I don't remember if it's good for one of the minigames or not. Strength is good for the holding the door closed minigame. Serenity was good for the, uh, or is good for the hiding in the cupboard and then having it here and having to do the heartbeat. So that's something to keep in mind with like Alexander who has really low serenity but very high strength. And for the most part the others are pretty balanced. And I do believe Sophia has the highest serenity. Anyway, so and I don't think... Well I guess we'll find out one way or the other 
if this is the end for her. But apparently it's very obvious if the presence is showing up because there's black stuff appearing all over the walls and floors and such. Well, let's go. Let's see whether or not she's going to die from this. Nope. But the game's still loading and everything. I don't like the noises I'm hearing. You do need to remember which door... Uh... That... That does not look good. Let's, uh... No. <laughs> I don't like the look of that. That's... That's bad. Let's, uh, let's go this way. I want to run, but we shouldn't run. Yep, there was something back there, I think. God damn, this game is excellent at being super scary without doing jump scares. I could hide underneath that table if necessary. Oh, it's from the flashlight. Why is it creating... Huh, okay. Just, uh, weird... Weird things. Yes, and we can do this, I do believe. Mm -mm. Uh, if I could stick this ring together with this piece of metal in some way, I don't know, how would you do it? I guess you need, I don't know, tongs? Hang on, hang on, hang on, hang on. Combine. Uh, nope. All right, well, never mind on that. <laughs> we just walked by a very creepy area for no reason. Uh, where did we have to go? I do believe now we can go in here. Oh, oh I didn't listen! <laughs> oh, I hope that wasn't bad. Uh, these photos seem modern to me. I think they took them in black and white on purpose. Oh, key. Uh -huh. Gold key. A small gold key hanging from a circle chain. The name written it down here is Masha. The servants of these fancy folks, they usually live in the same house. I bet this is their key. Okay, well, we got a door and it says Julia. You know, sometimes I think I can hear something. But then, I'm not sure. Oh gods, is this another hiding spot? Seems like a, nothing inside this wardrobe. So yes, here is another hiding spot. Oh, she has a skateboard. She can never stop competing that muchacha. She reminds me of my sister and me when we were little. Okay. I don't know what muchacha is. I feel like a little muchacha. Again, when I hear this kind of bands. These kinds of bands. Uh, poster of Alice in Wonderland. Q Lindo. Get in. Get in. I'm freaking out. Yes, it is very disturbing. Get in. It's here. The presence is here. So, are we just waiting for something to happen? Or did it pass? I think it passed. Wow, that is... Oh. Very, very terrifying. Mm -hmm. Julian Saul's recording. A voice recording of Husher's children. The label on the cassette reads, JNS September 14th, 98. Mommy's really scared. Watching 
So, is it watching through the mirrors? Because why break the mirrors? Uh, that has to be the girl's bed. I don't think anybody uses it for... Yeah, I don't think anybody uses it for a long time. What? Huh. Oh. Okay. Uh. Oh, super glue! A tube of super glue. Still has a lot of glue in it, and it hasn't dried up yet. Excellent. We... Where is it? Can combine that with this? Okay. Yes. Well, we got that. I hope this isn't a mistake. Coming out here. I just worry, like, we're gonna have to do the running and hiding thing, and I'm gonna freak out and forget where to go hide. It's my biggest worry. That and having Cora tackle the arm of the microphone again. Okay, sounds safe. How many bathrooms do they need? How did that glass break? Well, we already know about that. Uh, I, Madre, it stinks. The toilet is totally clogged. Yeah, flush it. Oh, ew. Can we use this? Holy shit, we're actually doing it. A black rag doll. A dirty old rag doll. The poor thing is all patched up. This doll is horrible and torn up all over the place. I think that's that ugly one. That was in the writing. Uh, Saul's writing? Okay. The house is really creaking. They moved the shelves to here. Oh, blocking a door. Weird. Why would they block that door? Okay, there is definitely stuff over there. We're not going over there. Yeah. Is the stuff gone on the floor? Yes. I am so thankful for that. Okay, so we can get into to that room. Oh, it's freezing. Uh, why is it freezing? I know that's the presence. It's cold. I just don't know what to do. She won't look up. Oh, everything is calm again. I hope it lasts. <laughs> no, it's not gonna last. Alina, you should have left. I was trying to get you to leave. You don't need to worry about any of this. You fixed it. I don't know, Severe? Oh, I forgot to listen! Okay, well, I hope this isn't... Everything's fine. The cabinet is full of folders and boxes with a whole lot of documents. Dear Sebastian, everything is falling apart. I don't know what is happening to my telephone, but I can't seem to reach you, which is why I'm writing this. As I do, I pray that it is not too late. Sebastian, do not listen to that music box. I repeat, do not listen to that music box. Every something is wrong with that melody. I hear it over and over in my head while I walk, when I read, while I eat or sleep, even in my dreams, and when I masturbate my prostate, and these are getting worse and worse. I feel observed, Sebastian. At first it was exciting, but it only happened in my dreams, but lately I also feel it when I'm awake, although I find it increasingly hard to tell the difference these days. There's something here with me, a strange presence in the halls behind each door I turn my back to. I don't know what's happening to me. I am so sorry, my dear friend. I, I curse the day I sent you that box. Isaac Farber. Third letter. Nothing on the back. 
Okay, well, poor Isaac. Oh, for the trap door. Metal hook, an expandable metal hook. Hmm. This hook is very handy to use if you are tiny and you can't reach something far away. Well, excellent. Now, which one? Oh, it was that door, okay. I'm just, I'm just waiting for shit to go down. Yeah, here it is. Let's, uh, go hang out over here. Because it isn't being brief. It's just hanging out with us. I wonder if standing still is a good idea, if I should just continue on. But I figure there's a hiding spot right here. I don't want to... Oh, yeah. It's getting worse. So, is shit gonna go down? Is it just making it easier for it to find me? I'm not sure. Ah! Oh, yep, here it is, here it is, here it is. Yep, here we go. <laughs> Shit. Spacebar, right? I don't know if I'm doing it right. I want to do it when the heart beats, not when it gets to the middle. I think she's doomed. Because she's starting to panic. Did she live? Holy shit. Holy. As if I... Holy goddamn shit. Okay. Let's go. We somehow amazingly survived. Okay. Oh. My heart is racing. My blood pressure must be so high right now. Oh, yes. Uh, we got something. Or is it... Come on. Just use it. So I hope there's something interesting in the attic. I hope there isn't. I don't You don't want interesting things to happen. You want every there's there's crying, there's crying, there's crying. Where's the crying coming from? Oh, here's the oval painting. I only see ugly emotions reflected in those faces. Yeah, yeah, that's right. Uh, the painting is from Jul 14th July, 1798, so 98. I am so sad when I look at the painting. It says it is from 1745. There is some scaffolding from an old construction job. I could reach it through the window. Hang on, hang on, hang on. Documents? Where is that document? Is it... So, this isn't the right window, is it? So there should be another pair of windows where the crying is coming from. Crying is bad. See? Who is that? We have no choice but to deal with that, and I don't want to, and I hate mannequins. Why do they have mannequins? Horrid mannequins. A cradle. People always say, Lena, you're going to become an old maid. They need to mind their own business. I agree. People give me a hard time. It's like, goddamn. I can't just create children on my own. Not that I want any. Uh, can I can I examine this? Because I don't want to examine this child. I don't like the crying. Yeah, I don't I don't think I have any choice in the matter. 
Excuse me, child, I just want to examine this painting. This painting makes me feel so lonely and lost. It is from 1922, the label says. Excuse me, child, I just want to examine this. My primo used a big stand like that. He was so slow painting, but he would make some nice paintings. Okay. What happened, baby? Are you okay? She's been taken! What? What is this? A crying friend, a parting gift, but only if they're themselves. What does that mean? Can I not? Oh, we found one. Ah. Uh, so that is one of three. She was right here. So desolate, it makes me want to cry. The painting is from January of 1811. So 98. Is this? Is this correct? God damn mannequin. Yeah, this is should be the correct one. Should I go out the window? Yes. Uh, Let's look. You can see it right there. Uh, oh, I guess that wasn't I scaffolding. No one at the company finds out about this. What would have happened? Oh, would we have slid off of that? So, which one do I go on to? Okay, that's that. I see they never finished their work. Wait, we're going down? I thought we would go up. Wait, which room is this? Oh shit, that's where the crying was. Like, how do I know what's gonna be? You know what, that one door, it did have crying but also had the sound of the presence. The sky is so beautiful outside of the city, I bet they can even see the stars and they don't have the presence here. I can't listen. I hope there's a Mom, hiding spot. There? Old souvenirs and notepads. The seniors of this house must travel a lot. Oh, and it did say Saul on it, and that's where they've been sleeping. Wait, except for... Where did the family go? Except Julia was in the attic. I'm assuming that's Julia. Please, come back. We can't leave the house. Yeah. Did he leave? Where are the seniors of the house? This bed was made so long ago. So he left. Left them to deal with uh, the presents. I could hide underneath this table. Good to know. We're in a safe area. Safe relative. It's a doll wearing a rag hat. She is so looking so dirty. Good idea to get ready for a shower. Oh, yes, there's a hint. This one will be taking a shower. I have three so far. Oh, we got the key for outside. We have matchbox, haiku. Haiku, can I combine them? Ah, uh, nope. Okay, well, I got two. I want to look at those albums, but right when I try, I hear the voice of my sister saying, Lena? Don't be a chismosa. Don't be a uh, mimosa. Those are private things. Okay, so what door is this? It's so eerie when it gets so quiet. There was like a ticking clock and stuff. Was this the hiding spot? Yes, okay. And there was another door over here. Oh. I removed the latch that was keeping the door shut. Okay. Oh, what's this? I see beauty in the common chores that appear in these drawings. They clean the mind and the soul. Okay, whatever that means. <laughs> Again, so weird. Yeah. Okay. Okay. It's okay. Mm -hmm. Fourth letter from Isaac Farber. Sebastian, I received the box again. I can't even stand to look at it, but still I hear its music. After returning it to me, has anything changed? Do you feel better? 
If so, maybe I should do the same, don't you think? I should try to find the previous owner, if that's even possible. Have you discovered anything? Please do tell me. I can't sleep or stay awake. I feel a presence. There is something here with me. God damn, that is creepy. How did the glass break? Oh, I don't know. Well, we can go... No, we already did the study. Oh, we can go outside, though. Water closets everywhere. They have, like, three bathrooms up here. And only one down there. So weird. Okay, well, I think this is a good place to stop for now. We got a safe hiding spot. And go back up to the attic. I, I don't want to go back up to the attic. Anyway, let's just pause it. Anyway, next time, we will go to that side door and check out uh, Masha's area, Masha and Alexander's area, and see what we can find. And maybe, just maybe, Alina might actually survive. Anyway, until next time. <laughs>